The whole month of November is dedicated toward bringing attention to men's health issues. It has been given several different names, but News 11's Peter Tarabarelli is here to tell us about No Shave November. Now, Peter, I understand that some people here have been shaving, and what's the whole deal with all this? Well, Shannon, that's right. We have taken part in No Shave November. We have a team of about seven of us, and we've promised to not shave our faces for the entire month of November. Now, we are challenging a team from Garden Spot High School to see who can raise both awareness and funds for the American Cancer Society this month. Here at News 11, six of our male staff members shaved for the last time. For the entire month of November, we are swearing off razors in an attempt to raise awareness. Called No Shave November, we are being joined by a team from Garden Spot High School. Each team member has their own story of how cancer has touched their life. I've had family members. Uh, we've obviously had students here. I've had former players uh, and I've had colleagues, you know, so it's obviously something that affects worldwide. This is kind of a, a way to raise awareness, raise funds, you know, anything that we can do or anytime we can do that, I'm on board for it. I'm doing this not so much for the money, but to get the word out to middle aged men and uh, go have that done, demand that it's done. When you go for your yearly exam, make sure you know what blood tests are doing. While I am leading the beards of Blue Ridge, the bearded Spartans are being led by a cancer survivor. I did the self-check and, and sure enough, I found a mass. I uh, went to my doctor within, probably within a week, and then I went to a urologist and he basically asked me, hey, what are you doing tomorrow? And I said, nothing. He was like, well, now you are. And I went in for surgery then that next day. Early detection is the key. So if you are a man, every time you see one of our bearded faces, there are a few things you need to remember. If you are concerned about, about your health, get, the, get that annual physical exam. Uh, that certainly cannot, cannot hurt. If you have cancer in your family, you should be having the screenings done. And there's different ones they can do for you. And, you know, some people take stock in a PSA and some people don't. For me, it's what found this. Uh, there's no other way. Uh, we would have found it because there was no, there's no symptoms involved with prostate cancer in most cases. Now, both of our teams have websites. You can find both on our Cable 11 Facebook page. Both of us also have the goal to collect about $1,000 before the end of the month. And I hear some of you guys have had these beards for a long time. That's correct. Members of both our team and their team have had beards, some of us, for upwards of four, five, six years even. So this was oh. a big step. Well, we will definitely be keeping tabs, and I look forward to those beards. All right. Thanks, Peter. See.